Hello, I hope you've enjoyed the series so far and I hope I will be able to find ways and means to keep providing you with different life transformative uh, measures, life transformative principles. This is the last in the part of the series. The last one is on empowerment that after you have experienced all the five that we told you earlier about and especially Poonatwa, when you feel a feeling of wholeness within you that you should feel empowered. You should become an empowered human being. And when we say empowered, that is a person who is able to deal with anything that life will give you, any kind of suffering, any kind of problem. You should feel empowered. This is a, this is a very important feature that very few people feel. Many times you find people break down. Many times you feel people feel fragile. People feel fragmented. But here I feel that if you follow this, just a little bit of a mental shift some kind of focus in life through our video programs, you should be able to experience this empowerment and become a whole human being. Now, so far what we've done is we've done the Experience Shiva program. In, I briefly talked about each video and told you about them. We have provided you six chapters actually. We have provided you two bonuses and we hope that you all will get interested enough to purchase the rest. And again, once again, I'd like to tell you that for 60 days it'll be risk-free. You can go ahead, you can experience Shiva, go to the Experience Shiva program, access it, purchase it, and see for yourself if you can feel transformed by it, if it can make a difference in your life. Go ahead and do it. Otherwise, there's no problem at all. If you don't feel that it's bettering your life in any way or it's not really suiting your needs or fitting your needs, you can always return it. Completely risk-free, you can return it. We will, in the meantime, be in touch with you. If you have any queries, if you have any questions to ask, we are there. Because I find that in this whole program, I have put in a lot of my own energy, a lot of what I have understood for the last 30 years, a lot of my own self has been put into these videos. And I feel that this is something that I can help people with. But along the way, I do feel that I need to look into the economics of it all as well so that I can continue to provide some kind of value to people who are interested in bettering their life, in becoming better human beings, in becoming stronger human beings, in becoming fulfilled human beings. Here I'd like to include that what, what would be interesting is that if in your, in your approach to trying to become a better human being, there are several mantras that are there. Different religions, even within Hinduism, will tell you about different mantras. But there's a very nice uh, line in a prayer, and that is Chidananda Rupa Shivoham Shivoham. Chidananda Rupa Shivoham Shivoham. That you should get the ananda, you should get the bliss that is required, that, that makes you happier as a human being. And that bliss will be there when you start feeling like you are Shiva himself. When you start feeling that the universal and your particular becomes one, when you become a unified feel, you are Shiva, Shivoham, Shivoham. There's no difference between you and the great God. This is one thing that you can repeat to yourself. Chidananda Rupa, Shivoham, Shivoham. A very potent sentence, a potent mantra. And one that is recognized the world over is something that I'd like to end with, and that is, Om Namaha Shivai. I, I pray and I give salutations. I bow down to the great God whose name is Shiva. With this, I'd like to end this, end this program, hoping that you would go and access the Experience Shiva program and you will benefit from it, that your life will become more fulsome, more wholesome, that you will become a better human being.